And, you know, Iris just said it. It is going to be hot no matter how you cut it. And usually the first few weekends of June are like this, and we end up seeing a lot of AC units go out. Yeah, they're working so hard. They just go kaput. Uh, we're taking action, though, ahead of the weekend to make sure that you know your rights. Katie Connor, live with everything you need to know. Uh, Katie, what do we need to know? Well, you need to know that if you're renting your home or apartment, you do have rights, especially in the summer heat. Right now here in the shade, it's 77 degrees, but Iris just said it's supposed to be 106 degrees. So if this AC unit goes out, you're going to be in a lot of trouble. Now, if you do rent, expert Ken Volk says it's vital that you know the obligations of your landlord and how to enforce them. Give them a written notice for failure to supply an essential service. If they don't fix it, you can try to fix it on your own and take that money out of your rent. But Volk says, again, it must to be in writing and you must state that you're exercising your rights under the self-help repair statute. Your notice needs to let the landlord know if they don't fix it in 10 days that you will do it on your own and take the cost out of the rent. But if you don't tell them that specific language with the 10 day notice, then you're going to be out hundreds of dollars of repair costs. And one thing Volk said you should never do is stop paying your rents unless you stated in your written letter to your landlord that you were going to do that. At the end of the day, Dan, it could actually get you evicted. Now, he does have a ton of tips on his website. We have a link, Dan, at abc15.com. Dan.